Anyway, this is my shower set up. On the roof of the van I have a 20 centimetre uh, conduit, it's plastic conduit and I've got corners on there, found this in the garage so it didn't really cost anything. I bought a £7 shower curtain from B&Q and a pound for the hooks on there. It's attached to a piece of timber here, two bits there and two bits there and then that is attached to the bulkhead here with two screws so it can be taken off and stored if need be. It's also obviously used as a coat hanger during the daytime here. Our system is based on this plastic large box here, it costs £6.50 from B&Q. It is 75 centimetres long and 45 centimetres wide, so plenty of space um, to shower in. And it's not only that, it's reinforced at the bottom, so pretty strong. At the side it says it can, can take 60 kilograms of weight, so I'm sure it will support my weight. Uh, underneath I've got a bit of uh, material here that stops it moving on the floor. Underneath we've got a rail so it doesn't move around, so that's going to sit in there. It's a box in situ. And, uh, now I the and there you can see it in uh, the shower curtain around the rail at top, which producing plenty of space to stand in and obviously have a shower. So I can stand here quite easily. Stand up. I've got headroom here to have a shower purchased a pump, electric 12 volt pump, it goes in my sink here, it costs £17.99 from Amazon, so it works, the water is pumped from the sink there, up into the shower, and then it's got the shower head here, which goes into the shower, and I've got control while I'm standing in the shower to switch it on and off. And there you go, for approximately total of about £30, I have a shower in my van. And not only that, I could take the rail off, attach it to the side pillar of the entrance of the van and use it outside.